Okay, if you want to update all of the value added status to a particular condition, what you want to do first of all is click into the value added column, which will bring up a little pop up here, and then you can highlight the rows that you want to change. So you come over here into the gray area to the left of the numbers, you click the first one, and it will highlight the row. Go down to the end of the block you want to select, it could be the whole study, click on that. After that, you can you do a shift click on that. So when it's, once again, you, you highlight the first row, go to where you want to end, do a shift click, and it will highlight the full range. After that, you can use the control key to select additional ones here. And then you say, I want to make them all non-value added. You click on the apply button here, and it'll change them all to non-value added. And if you scroll down a little bit here, let's go down. And you pick other ones here, let's say we want to do 43 through 50. So you just click on 43, do a shift click on 50. And let's say we want to make it a required non-value added. And again, we use apply, apply the update only to the highlighted rows. So again, these are all going to change in this case to required. So I click on the OK and it moves. But notice it jumps up here. That's been fixed. The jump is no longer there. This would allow you if you wanted to highlight the uh, all of this rows in a particular study. You just go to the first row. You said that re uh, re required or non-value added was the most common one. And then go to the very end of your study, do a shift key on it. And then you see you want to make them all non-value added. Click on apply. And they'll all change.